Hi guys! So today I'm back with a haul video and I am going to show it to you guys in my new jammies. I'm actually wearing, it looks, it's a two piece but it looks like a one piece. You can see it's all stripes. I love it. It's so comfortable. But anyway, so one more thing I want to bring up with you guys is that YouTube has this new thing, this new feature where you actually can like have like a web chat thing where you'll see me and you can interact with me live and I've done it in the past with blog TV and I thought you know what maybe I'm gonna try this so if you guys are interested in seeing me um, just make sure that you subscribe and also follow me on Facebook Twitter and Instagram so that when I do come on live you guys can talk to me so yeah um, I will probably announce it through one of my social media outlets when I do go on live but I can't wait to try it and see you guys because I miss you guys and I miss those fun blog TV things that we've had in the past. So let's get started. I'm going to start with my Sephora haul. Um, it's so it's a tiny haul, but it's things that I've always loved and kind of stopped using. This stuff, it's the Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray and it's by the Scandinavia brand. I'm in love with this stuff. And you just basically spray it in your T-zone, um, or you can do an X, but I usually just kind of do T-zone and just kind of do it my entire face also. And it's supposed to make your makeup last longer, and just your skin looks more healthy. And my skin was just getting really dry, I guess, because it's winter here and it's freezing, and um, I don't know, I just need a new foundation because my foundation has been looking really cakey and like just makes my face look so, I don't know, it just doesn't look like it usually does, I guess. So I've been looking for a new foundation and I actually got some help from Sephora. The girl was really, really helpful. I'm trying to find like an, a shade to match my skin that I can use for the winter time. I can just mix it with my lighter color BB cream and then during the summer it'll match my skin tone. Unfortunately, they ran out of this shade in store, so I couldn't buy it, but she gave me a sample just so I can try it out and mix it with my BB cream and see how it goes. And it's in the color Syracuse. It's a it's a darker color than my actual skin tone, um, but I definitely like to mix it with the BB cream. That's why I got it. It's okay, but actually, so I think, I can't remember how much the foundations are. But the NARS Sheer Glow is a couple dollars more than the Makeup Forever Liquid Foundation. And I think I am in love. This is already pre-mixed. So the color was originally a lot darker, but I mixed it to, mi to match my skin color right now. And it is in the color 170 Makeup Forever. So I think this is what I'm going to buy um, when I use all this. And then, ooh, I got some on my finger. No. Foundation gets so messy when it gets on your fingers and stuff. Ugh. And then I got this. This is the Their Real Mascara by Benefit. I just got like a little sample. It was 10 bucks, but it is worth it. I really, really, really like it. Um, I feel like it does make my lashes a lot fuller and like I just love it. So I think that I'm going to buy this when I'm done with my mascaras. But yeah, this stuff is really good, so I definitely recommend this. Like, at least try out the sample and see how you like it. Just my opinion won't do it because everyone's lashes, just like the lash type and like the way it curls and stuff is different. So just try out the sample and if you really like it like I do, like definitely get the full size. And I also got a couple samples because I think I had like 200 points or more. Um, I got this. This stuff is so pigmented it's called it's color three mightiest maraschino chubby stick intense moisturizing lip color balm I actually put this on just to try it and it was so bright so be careful you get this sample i don't know if i like it or not i feel like i tried it when i was at i because i bought this when i was on my lunch break and so when i went back to work my face was a little greasy and i was like oh, i'm gonna touch up with this and see how it works it's darker than my skin tone lesson learned because I put it on and I was like oh no it looks a little bit dark for me so I just put it all over to try to match it and it kind of became a disaster and then I also ordered a couple things online um, from Macy's I've been loving just getting Lancome or Estee Lauder stuff through Macy's just because they have a decent deal I think and like the shipping is free so I like that 
got the Double Wear. This is actually my current favorite mascara. It's a lengthening mascara and it's zero smudge, which I really like because I love to emphasize my bottom lashes, especially when I'm at work and I can't wear eyeliner or a lot of makeup. Um, I just love to have like extremely long looking defined lashes and this is by Estee Lauder. It's my current favorite. I actually found out about this because there's a sample that my mom gave me and I tried it and then I just happened to have loved it and then decided to get the full um, size. And then I got this. I don't know where my Definisil mascara um, thing went. So I can't show it to you but it came with an art liner. I've tried this in the past. I actually found out about this from Lorraine from The Current Custom and she loves this and swears by it. So I've always loved this. I also like the Alternative which is a drugstore brand. Uh, Revlon Color Stay Liquid Liner is really good also but this stuff is good. And then comes with a um, this thing by Facial uh, makeup remover. I actually use it. I love to use makeup remover when I go to sleep and wash my face and stuff. So this is what it looks like. Now I just created trash, which I will stuff back in this box. I got this recently too. It's actually a Hollister fragrance. It's called Malaya and I just love the little squeezy bottle thing. It's like, I don't know, it's so fun. And it smells really good. I've always liked this smell. So it's like a little bit of like a florally, I don't know how to explain it. It's like a warm florally smell. I've always liked this. All right, so let's move on to my little haul that I got on that. Oh, look, this is what I have on my lips right now. And I also have like a lipstick underneath, but it's Lip Fusion. So I, about like a month ago, I went into Sephora looking for Lip Fusion because I am in love with the brand. Um, I've used it about five years ago. I can't remember how long ago, but I still have. I've just like kept using whatever I bought and I haven't really gone into Sephora to buy it again. And when I did, it was all gone and I was really sad. So I saw this sale on Outlook and I could not refuse it. It was a really good deal. First thing I got is this, is in the color uh, Lip Jolie. It's like a pink color. And then I also got this. Ugh, I feel like it's a little bit dirty because I used it. It's called Gossip. I don't know about this color. I feel like it's more for like fair skin because it didn't really do much for mine. Because my skin is like a medium olive color, so it did not do much. I really like to use berry tones and stuff like that are darker for my lips usually. Got a lip liner. It's in like a red color. I usually don't use it unless I use red lipstick. So I decided to get it because I just feel like wearing red lipstick lately. So got another one. It's in the color Angelic. It's like a muted pink color. It looks really pretty. I'm so excited. I love the lighter pink. It's in the color Cherub, so I hope it works out better. It's like a brighter pink. And then I got this. This is like one of my favorite things to get from Lip Fusion. It's just like the little sample pack. I love to wear this um, and put it in my purse and just pop it in there and then whip it out when I need it or whatever. It's the Shine Sensation pack. I've gotten something like this in the past when I first found out the brand like years ago and I really liked, liked it. So I decided to get this again. And then I got this. It is a brightening illuminate thing. I think it's like a highlighter or something like that. It looks really pretty. Oh, actually, maybe it's like a primer. It is a primer. I lied. I haven't tried it yet, so I can't tell you if I love it or not. But I am so excited. Let's move on to the clothes. Um, so I just picked this up from Free People. Oop, my little brushy fell. Uh, it's just like a waffle top, like a thermal. I got it in gray a couple weeks ago. It's $29.99. It's um, on clearance, and there's a 20% additional off, and I really like the gray one, so I decided to get this color. Love wearing waffles during the winter time. I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like not a lot of stores sell waffle tops anymore. They're like well fitted and comfortable and yeah. And then this is what I found. I actually went shopping with my boyfriend for a suit 
and he decided to get um, one from H&M for really, really cheap. And as I was shopping with him, we're about to leave, and I saw this dress just hanging there. And I was like, this is really adorable. It is kind of like a body-hugging lace nude color top from H&M, and it was $30. It has like a little V-back. It is adorable, and I just had to try it. I got it in a small. The extra small was so tight on me, and I couldn't even like get it on. So I had to get the small, and it fits perfectly. I love it. And then, oh, there's more stuff that I got from Outlook. I think I showed this to you guys in one of my previous Outlook. Um, or maybe it's on Instagram that I showed it to you guys. But I love it. It's by La Femme. And it's just like a short little cocktail dress in like a mauve color. So pretty. I actually had to exchange it for a different size. Well, okay, so I returned what I got from Outlook. And then that sale happened to have come up again. So I got it in a size 2 instead of the 4 because the 4 was so big, it just did not fit me right. And I got this. It is so cute. I'm not a big one strap fan, but look how adorable this is. It's like a slate charcoal color. Oh, so before I finish, there's one last thing that I want to share with you guys. And alright, so I sold my old one, but... I got a new one from Best Buy and it was an open box. Really good deal and it's a retina. So I'm so excited about this because I haven't had a laptop in like a year and a half, two years. So I'm excited to get a new one. It is beautiful. Look at her. So pretty. I'm a computer person so my boyfriend helped me get this because he is. Um, but yeah, so I am excited to try it out. I hope you guys enjoy this video. And like I say during all of my videos, if you've tried out any of my DIY makeup hair videos, please share a picture with me on Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook, and hashtag AhanBarbie. And I will see you guys next time. I love you all. Bye.